we have an incredibly close relationship with two countries uh, that are interwoven in our economies and our cultures and our in our uh, in our peoples uh, but uh, we have uh, uh, a good uh, a good partnership and there's always ways to improve it always issues we need to talk through and that's why having a uh, uh, an ongoing constructive relationship uh, uh, between the president uh, and the prime minister is really important and I'm glad to be able to uh, uh, meet with you here again today merci beaucoup mr president NAFTA did. we'll see what happens we have a tough negotiation and uh, it's something that you will know uh, in the not-too-distant future, but we are going to be discussing NAFTA, and we'll be discussing defense. But we'll see if we can do the kind of changes that we need. We have to protect our workers, and in all fairness, the Prime Minister wants to protect Canada and his people also. So we'll see what happens with NAFTA. But I've been opposed to NAFTA for a long time in terms of the fairness of NAFTA. Uh, I said we'll renegotiate. And, I mean, I think Justin understands this. If we can't make a deal, it'll be terminated, and that'll be fun. They're going to do well, we're going to do well. But maybe that won't be necessary. But it has to be fair to both countries. It's possible we won't be able to reach a deal with one or the other. But in the meantime, we'll make a deal with one. But I think we have a chance to do something uh, very creative that's good for Canada, Mexico, and the United States.